Okay, now it works. Coming through. Hey, thanks for the follow, dude. Anyway. Let us continue with the video game. And th thank you for the bits. Much, much appreciated. Welcome back to Sui Coden 2, everybody. Uh, little, little bit of footage is going to be missing there, but it was literally just me getting on a boat, passing through Banner Village, and we're heading to the Torn Republic. Haven't really missed anything. No, no story has been missed. How are you doing, Dev Gamer? Hope you're having a wonderful day. Looking for retro streamers, you don't know. Well, you found an excellent one, my friend. I implore you to take a take a look at my video VOD collection. Because apparently it's actually totally weird to highlight like every game you play and save it. But that's what I do. <laughs> is so strong.
what are you running on? Uh, this is PSX, EPSX, I think. I have a, I also have a Sui Coden 2 save editor that I like to mess with. PGA Mister Systems? FGPA? I mean, in, in, in my house, I have a, a USB modded PlayStation Mini, which serves me quite well. But what I really want, what I really want, baby, what I really want is a Retroid Pocket. A Retroid Pocket 2 Plus. The king of Flash consoles, right there. Hey, who are you? Where do you think you're going? We are on our way to the Torn Republic. Then it seems we have a problem. I am Varkas, Chief of the Border Patrol. I cannot allow outsiders to pass through here. On what business do you seek to enter Torin? Chill out, Varkas. This is Rio, the leader of the Sloth Army. He just needs to see my dad. I understand the situation, but I can't let state citizens freely enter the Republic. Allow me to escort you to Gregminster, the capital of the Torn Republic. Really? Well, thanks. How about it, Rio? Come along, this way. Thanks, Varkas. I'm sure President Lapont will want to meet you, too. FPGA is basically a set of chips directly end play. Ooh, that sounds cool. The Retroid Pocket can emulate everything up to GameCube, and I gotta be brutally honest with you, I don't really care about emulating anything past the GameCube, so... Uh, to think that we're in the Scarlet Moon Empire, uh, I mean, the Torn Republic, makes me nervous. Hmm, I can't believe he's keeping his own son waiting like this. Uh, I'm a little nervous. I wonder where the, uh, where the bathroom is. Sorry to keep you waiting. Please follow me. Oh, alright, let's go. I'll, I'll be okay. Yeah, I, I to I get what you mean. It, it's per, it's, it's one-to-one, -one, yeah. I'm sure it's very pricey, too. Well met, Sloth Army Leader Lord Rio. As President, I welcome you to the Torn Republic. Now, what would you like to discuss? Forging a state with you. Lord Rio, when this land was ruled by the Scarlet Moon Empire, we fought constantly with the city-state. Even after the Torn Republic was established, we battled the armies of Tinto and Southwindow, who invaded in an attempt to take advantage of our internal discord. Yo, they got discord leaked. And despite all this, you seek to form a state among such long-standing enemies? If Luca Blight succeeds in destroying the city-state, the Torn Republic will surely be his next target. This Luca fellow certainly does seem to have an unquenchable thirst for battle. Hello, John BZ. I think the best thing about this game is one in, is on one and two trying to find all the characters. It was always fun. I completely agree. As a citizen of South Window, I fought against you with Lord Grand Mayor. Naturally, it's hard for me to ask for your help. But Luca Blight seeks nothing less than the destruction of all citizens of the city state. I'll do anything for the people of the South Window. So I beg of you. Please reconsider our quest. Our request. My brain is like. Blah, 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 blah. Lord Rio, why do you continue to fight? Hmm. You are much like him. 
I may be the president of the Toran Republic, there's a young man who should be sitting on this throne. He led tens of thousands of soldiers into battle and finally brought peace to our land. I see the same glimmer in your eyes that I did in his. You too represent the hopes and desires of all those who follow you. Tesla, how many men can we deploy immediately? Counting the Capitol Guards and the Border Patrol, about 5,000 men, sir. Then there's the matter of who will lead them. General Valeria has come to Gregminster to report from Plan Panu Yakuta Castle. Kasumi, the Vice Chancellor of Rokaku, is also in town for military training exercises. Either would make a trustworthy leader for our army. Let's call them in here, sir. Valeria, reporting as ordered. Called for me, President Lepon? Lord Rio, allow me to introduce Valeria, one of Republic's six generals. Her skill with the sword is unrivaled. I am Valeria. Greetings, Lord Rio. This is General Kasumi, Vice Chancellor of the Hidden Ninja Town of Rokaku. Nice to meet you. Please call me Kasumi. I trust both of these women with all my heart. Lord Rio, which would you like to accompany you? Okay. Valeria's cool, but outside of her having, you know, some unite attacks with various characters, she's not crucial to any, like, real strategies. Like, she has a, a falcon rune locked onto her, and the falcon rune is cool. Uh, she might have some dialogue with Anita or something, but Kasumi, even though she's also not super useful in any particular strategies, having her in your army means you get to go check out a cool secret location that you cannot go to unless she's with you. So I'm taking Kasumi. Thank you, Kasumi. Very well, President Lapont. Lord Rio, I will do my best to assist the Sloth Army. Uh, we're about to go on a character grabbing spree. Uh, as soon as uh, this, this right here. As soon as he gives me this. This is the Blinking Mirror, one of the treasures of the Torn Republic. It was used in our war for independence, but now I suspect that you have more need of it than we do. If you use this item, you will instantly return to your castle. In the absence of its rightful owner, I respectfully loan it to the Sloth, Sloth Army in your care. Yes! Oh baby. Good for you, Ryo. That should help you out. Well, good luck to you. Me? I'm gonna stay here. I'm out of play money, and besides, I just hate fighting. What's wrong, Dad? Ow, hey, let go! I have a request for you, Lord Rio. Take my idiot son with you. He's not worth much, but maybe you can make a man out of him. Dude, he's one of the best characters in the game. Wait a minute! Fool! Sent you into the world on a training mission! But you just frittered your time and money away. Learn from Lord Rio's example and end your childish behavior. And don't come back until you do. But, but... I entrust him to you, Lord Rio. Let's go, Lord Rio. We're running out of time. Gina, move. Yeah, yeah. mirror thank you very much chief Farkas we can handle it by ourselves now I understand be careful yes thank you well let's hurry Lord Rio there we 
we go. Spy! You expect me to believe you just accidentally stumbled across a town as well hidden as Rokaku? I've missed you, Lord Hanzo. Kasumi? Aren't you supposed to be with President Lapont? I was, Lord Hanzo. President Lapont ordered me to assist Lord Rio, leader of the Sloth Army. Hmm, a wise decision as I'd respect as I'd expect from President Lapont. I agree. But the Pi Highland Kingdom is a powerful enemy. Please, could you relend us Rokaku's assistance as well? Kasumi, are you here on Lapont's orders? No, sir, but I firmly believe that helping the Sloth army will aid Rokaku as well. This is my decision as Vice Chancellor of Rokaku. Please, Lord Hanzo. Hmm. That glitter in his eyes, it brings back memories. Mondo, Sasuke, I want you to go with Kasumi and join Lord Ryo's fight. Yes, sir. Yay! Hey, bet you're happy to be back with Kasumi again, eh, Sasuke? What? What's that supposed to mean? I, I'm not... Shut up! <laughs> Did you see him blush? Did I do something to upset him? Don't worry about it, Kasumi. He's always like this. I'm sure he's around here somewhere. Counting on you, Mondo. Won't let you down, sir. Shall I accompany you now, Lord Ryo? No, that's okay. We'll go ahead to Eoden Castle. Take good care of my men. Urgh. Found this strange crystal in the woods. I have no use for such a thing, so I'd like you to have it. Ice. Can't even talk to that guy. He's busy. Even the path of the ninja begins with but a single step. There you are. What? What's wrong, Sasuke? If there's something you don't like, tell me and I'll try to be more careful. It's... I, I told you, it's got nothing to do with you, Kasumi. And what are you so angry about? Well, it's... You see... Okay, fine, I'll go with you, but only because Lord Hanzo ordered it. Nothing to do with you, I mean... Uh, uh... Thank you, Sasuke. Yay. Just gonna go ahead to Eoden Castle, I guess. There's no rush. I can't remember, do you need any of these? Uh, Breath of Fire 3, I've heard of it. Never played uh, Breath of Wire Breath of Fire though. Look at that guy, he's just hanging from the ceiling. The hamlet of Rokaku is the secret home of the ninja. This town was reduced to rubble three years ago, but now it's completely rebuilt and better than ever. Come from outside, we rarely get visitors here. Well, that's it for Rokaku. We got a couple of bonus characters, and uh, now we can go.
That's a lot of tigers. Got cool abilities combo in belt. Huh. Oh, I see. So Breath of Fire Three sounds pretty neat. Is that PS2 or 1? We're here to meet you, Lord Ryo. Kasumi, is that really you? It's been a long time. I'll do my best to be of service. We'll do our best. Lord Ryo, the Highland army is approaching. Luca Blight must be back. Let's hurry to Aodin Castle. You don't have a second to spare.
be in the Great Hall. I'm sure you're exhausted, Lord Rio, but please go to the Great Hall first. Yeah, we'll do that. But... see do any of these recruits I'm about to go grab need uh, pe specific people in my party oh yeah I need Shiro in the party Oh boy, there's so much we can do right now. Oh boy. Alright, let's fend off. Let's fend off. Fend off. Blight first. Actually, no, I'm gonna- I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna grab a couple. Uh, I need a sound set in my inventory. Should bring those over to the kitchen. Talk to Vicky. Okay, we got a lot of places to go.
We don't need Clive right now. We'll need him later, but not at this exact moment. Need dog. Where dog? Give dog. There he is. These elves are weirdly strong for some reason. They have a lot of HP and they do a lot of damage. A voice. Hmm. You seem to have a good master, and... I see you two are fighting. Rio, do you see a better future? Lord Rio, I can hear, shining inside you, the voices of many. They have faith in you. So many place their faith in you, I might as well do the same. Pleasure is mine. Lord Rio, I have here some hearing ear crystals. They have the power to reveal the voices of the forest. I sense that they will help you. Please take them. She'll head for Euden Castle. You ever get stuck on getting a character? Yeah, I had to download a save editor so that I could get Clive because I missed the first cutscene. 
Afternoon. Ah, is that a sound set? We phonologists use them to create sounds, you know. Take good care of your sound set. They're very precious. Join you, hmm? Okay, I'll join you. The sound of your heart. It is very clear. Connell! You, I think I'll be able to hear many new sounds. The sounds of people's hearts. Sick. Ida, get out of the way. Why are you trying to save this beast? Move. No. Your parents were killed by those beasts. Have you forgotten that? No, I haven't. Then why? I can't allow a weak, injured creature to be killed. If its wounds heal, it'll come back to attack us. You cannot say that for certain. And if it does, then I will fight. It's a monster. Of course it'll attack. You cannot separate the world into people and monsters. Taking a life in battle may have meaning, but this is murder. Nobody listen to her. Kill the beast. Stop. Are you threatening us? Hey, look. It's just a little peep. Come on, kill it. They aren't this one's friends. Can't have this one. You listening crystal is shining. Thank you, kind boy, kind girl. My name is Feather. I will lend you my power. That voice was I am Ida, you are? I see. The Sloth Army. So the war still continues. Rio, I will join your cause. With you, I will put an end to this fighting. Yeah. The reason I live as a guardian. My father's soul still lives within me. Or I treat this one, I will follow you. All right. So that's Feather and Ida. Final Dado. Okay, next we go to Raddit.
Oh. Ratted is still occupied? That's unfortunate. A south window? Be around here somewhere, isn't she? Oh, she's at the end. Progress the plot then. This is a cursed letter. If you don't pass it on to five more people, you'll be cursed. Have a nice day, Sid. 
What a lovely guy. Okay, story. Lord Rio, glad to see you're well. It seems you were successful in forming an alliance with the Torn Republic. My name is Kasumi, Vice Chieftain of Rokaku Hamlet. President Lapont has ordered me to assist you to the best of my ability. I hope I'll be of use. I'm gonna depend on you. I'm grateful, we've got a real chance to win now. If you're so sure, according to my information, most of the Highland Army has already left Muse and is headed this way. Luca Blight's first company and Jawi Atreides' third company, plus the fourth company, made up of General Kiba's former troops. Reinforcements from Harmonia. That's a force of 50,000 troops. 50,000? Calling for reinforcements from Harmonia. Looks like Luca is planning on finishing this in one decisive stroke. It may be friendly nations, but that help from Harmonia will come at a high price. As for our side, even if you add General Kiba's soldiers and the reinforcements from Torin, we've only got 20,000. More than twice our numbers. Lord Rio, you still look tired. Get some rest. We'll finish this conversation tomorrow. Worrying won't help things anyway. Rio, what is it? I thought you'd gone to sleep. Rio, how did all this happen? When it was just the three of us, you, me, and Grandpa Genkaku living in Kiaro, I couldn't have imagined any of this happening. Grandpa Genkaku was the hero of the city-state, and Ryo is the leader of the Sloth Army. It's like some kind of bad dream. Now we really have to fight against him. Fight against Chowie. It's nothing, Pelika. It's okay. It's really okay. I'm sure it'll be okay. Ryo, go to sleep soon. Listen to me. Everyone is counting on you. That's why, that's why you have to stay warm and get to sleep. We'll be in South Window soon. Our best strategy would be to capture Radet, then South Window, and finally Eoden Castle. No. First we strike at their heart, destroy their headquarters, and the war will be over. Lord Luca is king of Highland. The king has his own ideas about how best to proceed. Let us be the advance guard. Hmm. As you like. I will also accompany you. We came from the distant land of Harmonia, and my soldiers are bored from the long journey. Good morning, Rio. I'm sorry about what I said yesterday. I guess we have to fight. But be careful, Rio. Lord Rio, the Highland Army has appeared in Radat. Lord Ridley has deployed to check the enemy's numbers. The odds have been against us in almost every battle, but this one will be the toughest. If we lose here, Two River will also fall to the Highland Army. If that happens, the fate of the city-state is sealed. I don't want to think about that. That Prince Luca Blight, no, I mean King. Report! Lord Ridley's forces have been ambushed and surrounded. At this rate, they'll be wiped out. Please send reinforcements. What? A general like Lord Ridley ambushed? I didn't think the Highland Army had so many good people left. 
Could it be Leon Silverberg? Lord Rio, let's send reinforcements right away. We can't let them kill Lord Ridley. Prepare to deploy. Stupid of me. Caught in an ambush. Caught in a trap, huh? Well, there's not too many. This will just require a little finesse. Finesse, huh? Sounds like you're talking about cooking. Just have to wait for the reinforcements to come. Hey Alex, what's up? Just something I can emulate is, is the kind of game requests that I'm into, that I can fulfill. I mean, old man Ridley looks like you're having a tough time. Need some help? Don't be stupid. Just hurry up. Lord Rio, we can't lose General Ridley, but please retreat as soon as we save the kobold unit. What's this? This is wrong. Something feels wrong. So, it's him. Comic Zone? Okay. Yeah, I can play that. I'll just have to get it set up and whatnot. But yeah, I can play that. I know it's one of the hardest games ever made. I think. dead what <laughs> uh hang on you can't die apple what the fuck <laughs> Maybe it's just luck, honestly. Yeah, see now he's he's gonna hit. It just depends if he succeeds at these dice rolls. Ape escape one? Uh yeah, sure.
No, he's gonna die again. Don't die. Please don't die. Don't die. God damn it! How am I supposed to save him? He just has to... somehow... She just killed that guy. I would have made things so much easier. No! <laughs> oh, he didn't die. He's not dead, right? Okay. Okay. Uh. Alright, Apple. Please do something. What are you all waiting for? This is how to fight! Oh, please don't die, Ridley. No! Ridley! Oh my god, I can't. I can't just let him die, Dad, dude. Okay. It's absolutely nothing.
Holy shit, okay. That's good. <laughs> oh my god. He's hanging in. Apple. Can't leave it to Apple then, apparently. If I attack first, will, will things be different? Okay. Suck, Teresa. You're of no help at all. <laughs> this is so nerve-wracking.
God damn it. Really? At this point, I really just want this to be over. Like, come the fuck on. Why do you guys suck? It's like you can't hit anything. Finally. Oh my god. Okay, get out of the way, please. Constantly just putting dudes in my way. Couldn't just let you die here, could we? Lord Rio, shall we have our troops retreat? Oh my god, finally. Lord Rio, please forgive me. It was my fault that I fell into the enemy's trap. Thank you, Lord Rio. I won't forget this favor. Winning or losing is a matter of luck and timing. Amen to that. A fucking men. Winning or losing is a matter of luck and timing. No shit. Forget about that. I want information about the enemy. <clears throat> okay. So. Uh, that part is really, really hard. Uh, if you... If Ridley gets killed... The game does not hold it against you. It puts his son... Uh, I don't remember what his son looks like. But anyway, his son takes over if he dies at that part. 
And then his son becomes his Star of Destiny instead of him. I think that's how it goes. The enemy has already occupied Raddit Town. Next, they'll be aiming for South Window. They've got 55,000 troops. Luca Blight leads the first company. Jowie Atreides leads the second company. But it looks like a new general is leading the fourth company. Also, the Army of Harmonia is being led by Sasserai, High Priest of the Holy Kingdom of Harmonia. Sasserai? I know him well enough. Leave him to me. What do you mean you know him? I don't have to tell you that. What did you say? Hey, hey, don't fight with a kid. That's right, you should be embarrassed losing your temper like that. <laughs> Look at such a dick. Damn, that guy. If he's aiming for South Window, he'll probably attack by the book. He's got three times our numbers, so he doesn't need to be tricky. In that case, our strategy will be... It's a strategy you're looking for. I've already got one. I'll explain tomorrow. For now, rest the soldiers. Captain Gengen showed me how to use a sword today. Captain Gengen is so strong. Gebocha. I have a pretty big castle now. Rio, I'd like to talk to you. Is it okay? I left some tools at my house. As a craftsman, it hurts me to part with my tools. I know that it's selfish, but would you mind going back to the house with me? That's all I came to say. I'm so embarrassed. Okay. Only a fool would allow a surrounded enemy to escape. Forgive me, Lord. Hmm. After ratted, it's South Window. What's after that? With this many troops, we don't need a strategy. The next battle will be the decisive one. We've a new, bright young general, so there's no need to worry. Who is that man? He's strong, but where did you find him? I knew him from long ago and thought his strength might prove useful to Lord Luca, so I summoned him. I don't care about breeding. A sword doesn't need a fine lineage, it just needs to be sharp. Hey, I was waiting for you, Rio. We can't start anything without our leader. Lord Rio, let me explain our strategy. Yeah, I'd like to hear it too, this strategy for success. We can't defeat 50,000 Highland soldiers with just our army of 20,000. Can't be true. Take it easy, we can def win without defeating them. Our only goal is to take the head of Luca Blight. If we can kill Luca, Princess Jillian will become successor to the throne of Highland. Then we could forge a peace treaty. Here's the plan. Rio, Teresa, Flick, Victor, Valeria, and... What? 
You mean Kasumi game. Nice, nice job, developers. Rio, Teresa, Flick, Victor, Kasumi, and Luke will wait with their troops in their designated ambush positions. Lord Rio and Lord Kiba will aim for Highland's main unit, free Lord Ridley, and then face Luca Blight in personal combat. I don't know if I can defeat Lord Luca by myself. You don't have to. When Luca shows up, I want you to pretend to retreat and draw them into our ambush. We can't defeat 50,000 soldiers, but if we can surround their general with our force of 20,000, victory is ours. I get it. You figure Luca Blight will chase after Kiba like a bat out of hell, eh? Father, please be careful. Yes. Lord Rio, if you're ready, please give the signal to deploy. Yeah, I'm not ready yet. First, keep going to South Window now. I can get. Oh, he's taking all these places. Whatever, fine. Okay, then I have work to do gearing up troops.
where is somewhere I can go that has a blacksmith that I can actually use? Uh... River? Two River, I think. Fine. Let me look at this list again. Can't go to Reddit. I could do the Path of the Unicorn. this house Forest. That's where it is. And it's, it's been a while. Sai has to be in the party. Du -du 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 -doy. Of course. Well, that's easily remedied.
been so long since I've been home. I really miss this place. Now, where are those tools? Hey, Dad, where were you? T Tomo, what are you doing here? I never hear from you, so I got worried and decided to come visit. Oh, I'm sorry, Tomo-chan. When are you and Mom going to make up? I don't know, really. Princess... Daddy, you need to get your life together. What are you doing with yourself now? Well, Tomo-chan, the truth is I joined up with the Sloth Army. Thought maybe my spear could be useful in the war. Daddy, well, in that case, I'm going to join the Sloth Army, too. What are you talking about? What's the problem? I can help the Sloth Army, too. Maybe I should tell Mom what you're up to, using your spear again and all. Tomo, wait. Your name is Ryo, isn't it? I know. You're famous. I've decided that I'm going to fight alongside my father. Please let me join. Tomo, why won't you listen to your father? Well, I'll see you at Eden Castle. See you later. Forgive me, Lord Rio. I'm embarrassed that you have seen me lose face. Alright, what's next? Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, okay. Oops. Okay, I get it. So, you can't, you can't teleport to Gregminster, but you can just walk there and be let in. Missed that the first time. Hey, Geo, what's up? Oh, yeah, we're good. Doing just fine. Oh, it's going great. We're just uh, picking up some straggler characters uh, before we progress with the story. I know I love I love the the way this game is presented it's so good
don't know why they make you walk this extremely long path. It's funny because this path is it, like ridiculously long and it's one of the only places that you can't teleport to from your castle. Which is just great. It's just that's just super cool, man. You also can't teleport out of the forest when you're leaving. You have to walk back. I guess it's supposed to be like a treat, you know, because it's a place from the first game. Yes. See, last time he just dumped me in the castle and then I progressed the story and left. But there's all kinds of things you can do here. Let's see. Things we can do here. In the trading shop. It's challenging you throughout your game. Who am I looking for here? Her? Yo, nice. Free stuff, let's go. This is the house of the character from the first game. Cleo! 
Welcome. Oh, you are are you the Rio President Laplante mentioned? It's Cleo. Cleo, can you join my team, please? I love you, Cleo. Check this out. He's got a picture of Ted on his wall. Ted is a guy from the first game. Sure, where is it? Somewhere around here. Was it here? Today's menu. Uh, Pawn's Diary. Just like in the first game, you can read Pawn's Diary. Today's menu. Salmon Manure. Uh, fresh salad, roast beef, almond jelly, and Ari Sushi. <laughs> a list of things he likes to eat. I miss you, Pawn. There she is. Good afternoon. Oh, you. You're the boy who came to see President Lapont. Rio, right? Come with you. Join the Sloth Army. But are you gonna win? Fine. Rumors tell of Sindar ruins near the city of Mews. And the goddess of victory does indeed seem to be smiling down on you. Yay. What do you want to do? You want me to join your party right now? Uh... Yeah. This is the house of the Flower General, Lord Millick. He's not in Gregminster right now, he's, but he's such a dreamy person. I'm sad you can never go into Millick Oppenheimer's house. There's literally actually nothing on screen beyond what you can see here. The house is actually not even fully, like, rendered. Part of it is just, like, blacked out to save memory. Welcome to Gordon's Mercantile, lad. Naturally, I see, lad. I mean, Lord Rio. I've been thinking about leaving the shop to my son, having a new one, and I heard that Shu, the famous trader, is in Jouston. I'd be happy to set up shop with you, but first, Lord Rio, I'd like to see what kind of business sense you've got. If you can make $50,000 by trading alone, I'll happily join you.
I think that's all I can do in Gregminster. Does this place have a, uh, a blacksmith? Probably not. I haven't gotten any of the blacksmiths so far. I haven't seen an opportunity to recruit any of them. Mina, Mina, where are you? Momo's right here, but... Oh, these are characters from the first game. This is so nice. Nobody who doesn't know the name of Lord Tyr, leader of the Liberation Army. The house of Lady Sonia Shulin, Admiral of the Navy. That was another character I had in the first game. Okay. Well, I think that's all I can do in Gregminster right now. So, all right. Okay, we're done in Gregminster. Sigh. Back through the woods. Is your favorite setup for your team? Like, all warriors, knights, or you like magic guys? I really like the characters that look cool. When I played this game when I was younger, I didn't understand what any of, like, I didn't know any of the stats mattered, like, that much. I thought Pesmerga was the coolest, strongest character because he was the last one you could get. I thought he was awesome, but then when you actually use him, he kind of sucks. <laughs> He's got absurdly bad speed. See, okay, yeah, I need to look up where you can actually, like, good blacksmiths. Give the recipes to this guy. Oh, shit. Cook off. I heard a rumor, but I didn't think you were really here. I'm shocked, Hayo. What the, who are you anyway? My name is Yu Kum. Yu Kum. I'm traveling around the world to become the greatest chef. His name is Yu Kum. Ayo, I challenge you to a cooking contest. If you win, I'll give you my closely guarded family recipe. Do you accept? What should I do, Lord Rio? Uh. Good luck, Ayo. What I expect from the leader of the Sloth Army. Okay, it's a contest, Hayo. Guess I've got no choice. Hello, everybody, and welcome. Oh, my God. Mondo! He misses his wife's fish cooking. It's Gilbert. Expert. He likes the food, too. It's... Strangest characters that eat and Breaks fear into the hearts of kids.
Chef, you come. Sorry, hang on. Okay, whatever. Do whatever you want, I guess. Alright, let's try this. This is not shit. Oh, I didn't like it. Did really like the teriyaki. Nice. I won. Your reputation is well deserved, Hayo. You're as great a chef as they say. This is my family recipe, handed down from generation to generation. You beat me fair and square, so it's yours now. Thanks a lot. Farewell, Hayo. I look forward to the day when we will meet again. Ha <laughs> ha! Neat.
Alright. Now we give the sound set to... Is he on the roof? Controller, please stop disconnecting. Yo, Fitcher, what's up? It's just Nina. There he is. Perfect. How do you get to the farm? This place is so big, it's actually hard to find things. Not this way. It's on the right side. I'm like... 99% sure it's on the right side. Isn't it? Hmm. Oh, this way. This is where I'm looking for. There we go. Who do I give this to? There we go. There we go. Okay.
All right. Okay. Lord Rio, is everything okay? Okay, let's deploy. General Kiba, we're counting on you. Also, Apple, call Sasuke and Mondo. All units report. Preparations complete. Lord Rio, until General Kiba appears, please don't move unnecessarily. Traitor, you join the enemy and raise your sword against me? You spit on the royal name of the Blight family. How dare you? You murdered your own king and sire, and still you dare speak so. He was my true lord, you little bastard. You! Cat is pestering me too. Okay, give the signal. Lord Rio, your target is Luca Blight. We won't accept your tyranny any longer. <laughs> so this is the Sloth Army. <laughs> is this all you've got? Think you can take the head of the great Luca Blight with such a puny army?
I'm here, Lord Luca. You're late! What were you doing? Forgive me, my lord. There was some trouble at headquarters. I'm here to assist, Lord Luca. Ugh. Give up, Luca Blight. You can't get away. <laughs> Doesn't matter how many people you've got against me. Rio! Ah! Damn. I knew it. Did it fall back? Fools thought you could take my head? Remember well, Rio, you weren't even able to wound Luca Blight. Even with all our planning, we weren't able to stop Luca Blight. I didn't want to believe that Braun could defeat Brains. Lord Rio, the situation has become too dangerous. I've got to retreat. Finally finished treating the wounded. There weren't as many deaths as I thought. It's rough. But we didn't know Lord Shu's strategy would be... Should we... You are Lord R Rio, correct? Who are you? So, Lord Rio, we finally meet. My name is Leon Silverberg. I'm a strategist for the Highland Army. Wh what's going on? What is a person like that doing here? It's easy to disappear in a group of fleeing soldiers. Lord Rio, please deliver a message for me. Give this letter to Shu. I cannot stay long. Please excuse me. Wait a minute. Well then, good fortune, Lord Rio. He's gone. What should we do? Lord Rio, how was it? An old man named Leon left a letter for Mr. Shu. Leon? Leon Silverberg? You know him? He said he was a strategist for the Highland Army. 
Lord Rio, can you show that to me? Shoo. Tonight, Luca Blight will lead a night raid. This will probably be our last chance. Deploy all the troops. Lay an ambush for Luca Blight and kill him. Night raid? But why would the enemy strategist... Maybe it's a trap? It could be. This plan is risky, but the rewards could be big. But on the other hand... Lord Rio, please make a decision. Okay. I understand. Very well. We'll place the army in the woods near Eoden Castle. When Luca appears, we'll close off all the exits. Then we'll attack Luca Blight with our strongest unit. Rio, create the unit that you think can defeat him. Select the party members for Unit 1. They'll be the lead unit. Hmm. 
Let's go, but don't use torches. I want our eyes as adjusted to the dark as possible. But leave the castle's torches lit. Wish we could have gotten a big raid or something. Or lots of people watching when we do this part. But that's fine. This is one of the coolest parts of the game, easily. Torches in Eoden Castle are burning. They're probably in there trying to figure out how to run away. Have a report. The advance forces are under attack by the Sloth Army. Lord Luca, the Sloth Army has appeared behind us. What? Hiding in the woods. You can't do anything right, you worthless fools. Lord Luca. Protect Lord Luca. You, how did you know about the night raid? Luca Blight, I want your head. Foolish braggart, you think a weakling like you can stand up against me? Miss?
Nice. Bruh. Beaten by the likes of you. This time I'll pay you back for sure, Luca Blight. You maggots! Victor and the bird are dead. Oh, wow. He's being very kind to me. <laughs> really? The bird missed. That's rough. Come on. 
fact he actually survived that is astounding. You can't win! <laughs> you went that way, Rio. Now he's about to get really stomped. Luca, your luck has run out. You have no soldiers and you're wounded. Can't break out of my trap. Trap! <laughs> All I can see is a bunch of squealing pigs! Rio, right here, right now. I'll separate your puny little head from your puny little body. Lord Rio, be careful. Oh boy, okay, here we go. Now shit is for real. Yeah, get him, Rio. <laughs> Humphrey's defense is so ridiculous. It's just it's just obscene, dude.
Just whoop his ass. Got him. Woo! GG.
you. How? How could I lose? You little swine! Who do you think you are? Why? Rio! Why are you the winner? Why must I lose? Is that my fate? Can't die until all of you swine are wiped off the face of this world! Go after him, Rio. We've come this far. We can't let him get away. I'll kick Chaco. And five. Luca Blight. Gather our archers. We're heading for the prearranged position. Can't let him escape. Let's go, Rio. You, I can't die here. Have I really lost? Damn, you think I'm afraid? You think I fear death? Fear is a stupid emotion. Uh. <sighs> what? Wooden amulet. What's this doing here? What's that light? Is this a cover? It's fireflies. There are fireflies inside. What kind of joke? Whatever it was, we'll pay for this. Stupid. It's not even worth taking. Stupid. This whole world. 
light. What's that? Shoot! Ah! Caught you, Luca Blight. Now you're finished. Finished, you say. <laughs> what are you saying, maggot? What are you squealing about, pig? I've got the power to take your life, boy. Lord Luca. Hurry, escape. My holy war. Don't interfere. You scum. Here I come. Rio. Ridiculous, you think a punk like you can stop me? <laughs> Draw. Uh. Oh. Get out of here, dude. You're okay, Rio. I don't have the power to swing my sword anymore. Rio, why do you fight? Why do you wish to destroy me? To end this war. It's a fairy tale. A foolish children's dream. Even if you kill me and defeat Highland, you won't have peace. You'll have a defeated country screaming for our vengeance. <laughs> excellent, excellent. The rumbling in my body, the thirst that scorched my flesh, it's disappearing. <laughs> Listen, Rio, it took hundreds to kill me. But I killed humans by the thousands. Look at me. I am sublime. I am the true face of evil. So, it's finally finished. Did we... Did we finally win? Lord Rio, let's go back. We won, and there are a lot of people who are waiting to hear news of our victory. Is that what you wanted? Yes. It's what I always hoped for. I want to believe I'm brave enough to accept fate. Did it. Did it, you did it! We knew you could do it, Lord Rio. You did it, Rio. You're really terrific. You beat those Highland bums. Great job, Rio. Great job. Helica, sweetie, we won. Rio won for us. Oof. 
Rio, what happened? Rio, hey! Let me take a look. He's okay. It just looks like he fainted. He must be exhausted. Carry him to his room. I'll take care of him. In the name of the ruler who her holds the circle rune, and the guardian who holds the beast rune, we hereby accept a shining new flame into the Blight family. Jowie Blight, Jillia Blight, we are here to record the vows made between you this day. By my body and by my soul, as the guardian of this place, as a knight and as a subject, I pledge to serve Jillia Blight. What is it? By my body and my soul, as successor of the Blight family lineage, I take you, Jowie Blight, as my husband. Furthermore, I confer upon him the title of King of Highland, and I pledge to serve him the rest of my natural days. I pray that you two shall find happiness as you walk together on your new path in life. Happiness on my path, eh? Good morning, Rio. Did you sleep well? I was so scared when you suddenly passed out like that. But you've been resting in bed and drinking my soup for a whole week now. You must be feeling better, right? Apple told us that the Highland Army is withdrawn. So, does that mean that this war is finally over? Morning, Lord Rio. Are you feeling better? We've defeated Luca Blight, but we can't relax yet. Don't let your guard down. You gave us a scare. When you passed out like that, Nanami and Ellie turned absolutely white with fear. A lot has happened. It's good for you to rest up. That last battle was glorious. You impressed me deeply. I would like to raise my son to be as brave as you. Looks like there won't be any battles for a while, and if Apple and the others do their part, the war might be over soon. Rio, let's go for a walk, okay? Ever since we escaped from Muse, we haven't had any free time. I want to look around in South Window and Couscous. Oh boy. Alright. Well, now we have so much to do. <laughs> Just a ridiculous amount of stuff we gotta do. Luca Blight has been defeated. Means him.
I guess you can come too. First of all, can I go back into Green Hill now? Wait, what? Am I trying to go to Green Hill? Must have pressed down by mistake. We go in. Still can't go in here. Okay, I guess that's later. Well, that's fine. There's only a per one person in there I wanted to go grab anyway. We'll get there. Okay, first of all, rat it. Guy wants to race me. He's gonna tell me how many vic how many times I need to let enemies go. Fifteen more? Okay. Hey kid, you want something with me? Well, I'm sorry kid, I've had nothing but bad luck in life. Bad luck and more bad luck. I lost my rose brooch that my dear friend gave me. Things get any worse? Maybe my friend will forgive me if I tell him how sorry I am. Dear friend, I'd heard that you were near and I had to see you if only I had that rose brooch. Where is it? He's not gonna tell me? Okay. Pig. Can I have that pig? Yeah. Give me a pig. I had the Celadon vase, it's in my storehouse, I'm gonna go grab it. Well, while I'm walking over to my castle, I'll just, uh, run away 15 times and then I can get Stallion.
Your stupid urn. It's a Celadon vase, all right. I knew you would do it, Lord Rio. Okay, gotcha. That's right, I gave him this angry scowl, and then Kiba just kneeled and down in front of me and begged me to let him join my army. I have that effect on people. And then? Well, you know, I got a big heart, so I took Kiba by the hand and lifted him up. I said, lift up your head, General Kiba. I can't kill such a fine soldier as you. Kiba was so moved, he said, Lord Rio, from this day forward, my life is yours to do as you wish. So anyway, that's how my sloth army beat the Highland army and got General Kiba to join us. That's why you've got me and only me to thank for saving this town of Raddit. Of course I know that, Lord Rio. Well, as long as you know, after all, the lot leader of the sloth army has got a big heart. No more sake left, eh? Some new fish wouldn't be bad either. Oh yes, please, order as much as you like, Lord Rio. Even the fish will be happy. To be eaten by such a great hero. Heh, <laughs> you got a golden tongue. <laughs> That's right, I'm the great Lord Rio. Excuse me, Lord Rio, can we see the bright shield rune on your hand? Oh, yeah, sure, I'll show you. But first bring that sake over here. Yes, I'll bring it right away. Good, well, okay, take a look. That's the bright shield rune? Looks different than I expected. Melting. Hey, you fake! It's just drawn on there! You're an imposter! Uh, thought something was funny. I knew Lord Rio couldn't be so small. Wait, wait a minute! I finally found you! You're the one using Lord Rio's name and eating and drinking for free! Pulled the same trick in South Window, Two River, and Rock Axe! Give up, you little creep. Well, wait, wait a minute. I, I've never even been to Rock Axe. Don't try to talk your way out of this one. Help me, please. What, are you a friend of his, too? He's using Taunt for two. He must be one of them. Let's kill them all. Well, if you've learned your lesson, don't do it anymore. B big brother, are you okay? Damn, but hey, I, I guess it's fate. Let's join forces, huh? How about it, bro? Hello, hoy. Okay, it's decided. Let's make up, brother. I don't want him in my party. Why do I have to put him in the party? He has to join your party. Oh my god. Whatever. Oh. 
All right, we got Hoy. Now I just need to run away from like nine more fights or something. the rose brooch. That's another thing I need. It's in the Rare Finds item shop in Banner Village. Okay. Four more, f four more fleas, and then he'll he'll join. one more and then I think I'm good. Come on. There we go. Alright, we're good on that. Come here, asshole. Wow, I didn't think there were such fast humans. Of course, I did let you win. Okay, I've decided. I'm gonna join the Sloth Army too. Of course I'll join. Of course, it's only so I can study how you run so fast. Yay! Oh my god, okay. Done with that. Good.
Hey, bro, isn't this Aoden Castle where the real Rio is? This is bad. Could it be... Are you the real? <laughs> hey, hey, bro, we're friends, right? <laughs> Idiot. Out of here, hoy. Okay. Teleporting to now. Hey, that's it, that's it! You must be the hero Ryo who defeated that evil demon, Luca Blight! Sorry to be late, but I'm Maximilian, leader of the Maximilian Knights! I'm here to help you! Lord Ryo, I beg of you, please accept my le pledge of knightly fealty! Thank you, I, Maximilian, will fight for you while there is still breath in my body! Okay. Thanks, man. Well then, I'll depart for the castle at once. We must begin getting ready. After all, it's the duty of a knight to be ready when to fight whenever his lord needs him. Okay, weirdo. No way, absolutely not. I'm running a business here. It's hard enough with this damn war going on. I'm sorry, but I don't have any money, and I'm not strong enough to do manual labor. Perhaps a song? Ever since Muse fell, they're all over the place. These refugees should just be glad we let them in here. Besides, who wants to hear a song these days? But singing is all I can do. Get out of here. Nobody needs you. I've got no food for people who can't pay for it. Yes, I'm sorry. What a dick. Oh, excuse me. May I get by? Thank you. I'm Killy. I'm following the trail of the Sindar. You heard any rumors about them? Alex. Oh yeah, the guy from the inn. Thanks, I owe you one. Now she's over here. You're the one from the inn. I was just looking at the sky, thinking, I wonder if Muse is that way over there. Yes, I, I don't want to talk. You overheard me, eh? I was working as a musician in Muse along with Pico and Alberto. Then the war came and everyone got split up. It's true, I'm worthless all by myself, and I don't have any gold left. 
But after talking to you, I feel just a tiny bit better. Would you like to hear my song? Thank you. I haven't sang in a while. I was worried it wouldn't sound good. Thank you for listening until the end. But, but I... Thank you. Yay! I don't know how to do anything but sing, but if my singing can bring even a little joy to the people who have suffered during this war, then I'll do it. Glad to meet you, Ryo. All right, so that starts the musician side quest, where I have to go find her two buddies that got lost during the war. Another interesting side note about that song you just heard. Uh, if you are playing this game on the original hardware or console or whatever, you might be like, I don't remember that part having any music at all. She just stands there silently for like a minute and a half. That's because it's glitched. In the original, that song just doesn't play when you when you ask her to sing it, and she just play she just sings the song completely silently, uh, and it's really awkward. But because I've got glitches patched on this version, it works properly. Hooray! Okay, so. We got Annalie. Alex's item shop. Now it's time to get the best character in the game. visiting Alex's item shop. Maybe it's down here. Oh no, it's another cook-off. God damn it. My goal is the achievement of culinary perfection. I heard the famous Hayo was here, so I came right away. Famous? Oh, come on, I'm not that famous. Be so modest. Please, let Goetsu face you in a cooking contest. Which I do.
Does mashing buttons do anything? I actually have no idea. Buttered clams. Ooh, they like that one. Oh shit. Oh good, they like mine more. Salad for dessert? I won. <laughs> Reputation is well deserved, Hayo. You have defeated Goetsu. That's not true, your cooking was terrific. At all, the victory was yours all along. Here you go. You got buttered clams. Okay, now where the hell is the item shop, though? Anyway, she's a, uh... She's a, a sound test, basically. At least until you get her band back together. Alright, where would the item shop be here? Empty rooms. Oh, there's Richard. There's the guy where you can gamble with him, make money.
Aww. Oh, this is our library. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What are you doing here? You didn't join us. Are you on the plaque? I could have sworn she she definitely did not join us. I'm in my, maybe I'm crazy. I'll tell you what's driving me crazy. Where the hell is this item shop in my castle? I don't, oh yeah, it's wherever my inn is. I have an inn? Bar, that's the storage. place is so big, I'm actually getting lost. What the fuck? My castle is literally so big, it's hard to navigate. This is the farm. This is not what I'm looking for. It's 
leads to this. Oh, I'm so dumb. Who are you? You used to run an inn called the White Deer Inn? Well, actually, it was Hilda that ran the inn. You opened the gate to the Sindar Ruins, right? Why would you do that? Alex! What are you doing to my dad? What did you find in the ruins? Tell me or I'll kill you. His life? I won't let you do that. I won't let you hurt Alex. This dialogue is so badly translated, it's like it's confused with itself. I'll ask you again. What did you find in the Sindar ruins? You don't tell me. Wait a minute, everybody. I don't know what you want to hear, but the treasure from the Sindar Ruins is right in front of your eyes. This is the treasure I found. You got a problem with that? Your words. They have the ring of truth in them. Sorry I was so rude. Forgive me. It looks like you've got some good friends. There we go. Can't say much, but the relics that were lift by, left by the Sindar should not fall into the hands of normal men. Can relax, that man wasn't lying. I won't go anywhere near there anymore. Want something? Friend, stop it. Besides, it's not something I would do. There's no reason for me to get involved in your war. While I was here asking for a... L rumors about the Sindar, a lot of people told me about you. Seems that I was wrong about you. That will be fine, but if I come across any clues about the Sindar, I want out. Yes! Till then, guess I'll stick with you. Alex, he's a lucky man. There aren't many who get involved with the Sindar and found something so valuable. Yes! Best character in the game, recruited. Okay, what's next? What's next? What's next? Uh, yeah, need the ruse brooch. That, got that. Uh. Okay, so Amelia. 
I gotta look at the. I gotta look at the t tablet of promise for a second. Yeah. I knew it. What the fuck? Amelia's in my library. Oh, she is here. What? Okay. I could have sworn I couldn't get her in Muse because I needed a level 2 castle and it didn't it didn't play the thing. Whatever. Okay, well, I guess we've gotten everybody up to this point. Pretty sure. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so if we have Amelia, then we're pretty much good. Uh, we have everybody... Okay. Uh... Alright. I think we can just... Got Killy. Gotta go to Couscous. Uh. All right, we're good. We can, uh, we can progress with the story. So what do they want me to do now? I guess I'll go to the Great Hall. Oh, Nanami wanted to go to Couscous. That's what it was. Well, Lord Rio, good timing. Everyone's all worked out because a Highland ship just arrived. Lord Rio! You're right, I've never seen him this close. Lord Rio over here, this guy says he's a messenger, but I don't know, should we rough him up? Thanks a lot. I thought I'd keep an eye out from here. What? 
I've seen you on the battlefield, but never face to face like this, Lord Rio. I'm Colgan, General of the Third Royal Highland Arm. Cap. Third Royal Highland Company. It's not the words I'm missing, though. I work under Commander Jowie Blight. I'm pleased to meet you. Jowie Blight? Could that be our Jowie? Yes, Lady Jillia, the sole surviving heir to the Blight family, has officially wed Lord Jowie. Jowie has now become King Jowie, successor to the Blight royal family and King of Highland. Huh? What? Jow Jowie is married? You two are friends of his. He wanted you to attend the ceremony, but unfortunately, it was impossible. So what do you want? S some kind of wedding gift? No, the reason I am here today is to make a peace treaty between Highland and the state. I've brought a letter addressed to Lord Rio, leader of the Sloth Army. Peace treaty? You mean... The war is over? Yes. If negotiations go smoothly, that is. Really? Really? You did it, Rio. I'm embarrassed to ask the Sloth Army leader, but could you take me to Aodin Castle? You deliver the letter here, but to prove that this is a formal peace offer, I'd prefer to do it there. Lord Colgan, you can't go by yourself. Don't worry. I want you to wait here. Lord Rio isn't that kind of person. I'll see you later. But of course, if it means the war will end, no problem at all. Did you hear? The war is going to end. Finally, I can live in peace. How do you know that? You can't believe a thing these Highlanders say. she is. What is your business? Want me to join your group? But I couldn't be of any use to you. Well, just one thing. If you can keep up with my dancing, I'll join you. Is that okay? You ready to start? Ooh, that was fun. Thank you, Rio. Well, a promise is a promise. I'll join up with you now. Yay! Making friends all over the place. Alright, well, I think that's all we have to do in Couscous. Let's get the hell out of here.
Alyssa's Aodin Castle, eh? Amazing. Yeah, okay, let's go see Shu and the others in the Great Hall. You're Colgan! Damn, get away from Rio. Please don't misunderstand me. I've come to negotiate a peace agreement. Peace agreement? Yes, Luca Blight has passed away, and the current king of Highland, Jowie Atreides, wishes only to end this terrible war. Say that Jowie has become king of Highland? I'm hoping for a peace treaty between the Highland Kingdom and the city-state. We should be signing the peace treaty with the mayor of the capital of Muse, but not possible now. For that reason, I request that Lord Rio and Teresa, acting mayor of Greenhill, accompany me to Muse. This is a letter from Lord Jowie Blight. Please accept it. Lord Rio, Lord Jowie is hoping for peace. Please, go to Muse City. Well, please excuse me. Farewell. So he wants me to go to Muse to sign a peace treaty? What do you think? Well, it could be a trap. Come on, Jowie isn't that kind of a kid. But Jowie Blight has Leon Silverberg as his strategist. You mustn't underestimate him. Could be a great chance. Highland is weak and we're strong. Perhaps we could sign a peace treaty with very favorable terms. But what if this is a trap and we lose Lord Rio? What will we do then? First of all, I don't believe that the Highlanders can keep their promises. Don't forget that this war started when they broke the last peace treaty. With Luca Blight gone, we can take Muse and Greenhill back from Highland by force! Everyone calm down. Why don't we ask Lord Rio's opinion? You say you're going to Muse. We're with you. Please decide. Lord Rio is acting mayor of Greenhill. I'm going with you. Shall we depart for Muse? Please bring Chaco here. He may be of some help. Please choose the other members of your party. I just did. Well then, please take good care of yourself. Rio, good luck. Give it to me. Rio's got the bravest member of the Winged Horde with him. You can rest easy. Right, Rio? Hm. I'm here too, you know. Lord Rio, to get to Muse, let's take a boat to Coronet Town to the north. Victor, Flick, I have a favor to ask. Whatever it is, I'm sure it's not good. It's my job. Okay, well... We will go to Coronet. But... I have something funny to show you guys. Now, this is definitely not... I don't even understand why this is possible, but there is actually an alternate recruitment scene uh, for a character that you can only get if you use the Matilda glitch to push a wall out of the way and go somewhere that you're not supposed to be able to access anymore. And it's the weirdest thing. You'll you'll see what I mean. It's not like a it's not like a majorly different scene, but uh you're supposed to bring basically you're supposed to bring Wakaba to meet LC Chan. LC Chan is in he's somewhere else and you're supposed to bring a village named Krom, I think, which is much later on. But 
if you are ridiculous, and you push the Matilda border out of the way, and then go to Rock Axe, something interesting happens. here. So yeah, you're definitely not supposed to be able to go back into Matilda uh, after your business is done there. But because we can, for whatever reason, one specific character has an alternative recruitment scene. It is the strangest thing. Now I just gotta find him. Is he at the inn? Yeah, there he is. This scene can only be seen if you go th if you glitch through the Matilda gate to come here. Because there is no way to come here with Wakaba before they lock you out of this area. Kaba, you're not neglecting your training, are you? No, sir. I Hey, hold on, you can't just skip out on the check after eating all that food. Master, Master! Kaba, I see your training has progressed. Yes, sir. As you said, Master, I learn something new every day. By the way, Master, just before you were... Well, the legs are the base of the body and the basis of unarmed combat. Strengthen them and you strengthen your base. Wow, that's great! Amazing! Of course. Be silent, Wakaba. Master? Quiet your mind and body while you train, Wakaba. Who is that with you? Huh? Oh, that's right. I'll introduce you. The leader of the Sloth Army. He uses Tonfa and his name is Ryo. He's really strong. Hmm. Master Ryo. Even I, the great Long Chan Chan, could not get past your guard. You've found a worthy teacher, Wakaba. Who is this man? I told you before, he's the leader of the Sloth Army, Lord Ryo. What? Did you say the Sloth Army? Just said it about a hundred times already. I see. Lord Ryo, Long Chan Chan, will lend you his strength until this is all over. Kaba, where is the Sloth Army's castle? It's Aoden Castle. You've already been there once. Oh, that's right. Well, Wakaba, you would do well to learn from Lord Ryo. Perhaps he can teach you some of Genkaku's way of fighting. I'm off to the castle, okay? Yes, sir. Master, shouldn't you pay for your meal? Mm, well, yes, of course. I was just testing your memory. <laughs> so yeah, that's a cool little uh, secret. I don't even understand how... Things ended up where you can have an alternate recruitment scene in an area that you literally can't go to without cheating. That's 
so weird and cool to me. Like, how many people are ever gonna see that that alternate scene? Because they don't even know that you can just push the wall out of the way. All right, sick. We got L LC Chan. Oh, I can't... I can't teleport to Coronet? Really? That's weird. Uh, okay. I guess I have to go by boat then. Um... Alright, alright, alright. Let me look at the list again. Okay, so we got Killy. got Karen. We got Maximilian. Hoi. Chan Chan. Alright. Okay. I'm so sorry, game, that I tried to save myself, like, five seconds of time. Mr. Dog, can you come with me, please? I wish I could bring that dog with me back to my castle. First of all, we have to put Killy in the party, because he's a freaking badass. So, uh, I guess it's time to kick Wakaba out. better stuff for him to wear. Oh yeah, and there's that uh, deleted item. I think I was going to show it earlier, but uh, I hacked this in just to show it off. Uh, it doesn't do anything. Uh, I think it's supposed to be related to Bado, but uh, it's a misspelt, dummied out uh, item called the Hood of Mindfulness. It's got something to do with Bado and talking to the animals, but not very clear. this weapon actually only level nine huh
Alright, let's go to Muse to sign the peace treaty. I'm sure nothing will go wrong. I think I'm gonna actually just end it right here for tonight, I think. Been going a pretty long time. Okay. good stream. Thanks for watching everybody.